Hey, what's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. In this video, I've got some unique, what look like portals in the sky. Video here sent in by Linda C. And a very unique sky portal. That's how the gentleman described it. Chris, a video from a home security camera looking up into the sky at something super, super unique. First, we're going over to Estonia, over here in Northeastern Europe where I just received, not uh, more than an hour ago, photos of the sun behind what appears to be wildfire smoke. And they asked if that could possibly be wildfire smoke from the Western United States. And it looks like to me it probably is if there is no wildfires in their immediate area. I've received multiple photos from Norway and I've received photos from Switzerland over in this general area of wildfire smoke interacting with the sunsets already this year. And here is yet another one from October the 2nd of 2020. Just incredible, that's traveled over 5,000 miles here at the website checking out the Schumann resonance looks pretty good all in all not too much activity Same thing over at the Yellowstone super volcano looks pretty quiet considering this is the new norm a steady flow of energy Around the super volcano caldera except for this one size mo here recently these are earthquake signatures and this is the only seismograph I found those on. So I don't know if this is something unique to the West Boundary area. Those are respectable signatures, so I don't know exactly what's going on there. But all in all, it's just another busy day at the Super Volcano Caldera. Got a photo sent in and a video clip by Linda C. Not exactly sure of the location, but it's a very neat photo and small video clip of what she was describing as sky portals. Portholes or portals, however you, you want to view these. They were symmetrical holes in the clouds forming a straight line in the sky. Look like windows out into space. These are still images and she also sent in like a, a six minute video clip like right here i just enhanced it just a little bit not too much trying to uh, pull forward some more of the features of those very unique holes in the sky so we go from holes in the sky to what appears to be a square in the sky that appeared on chris w's home security camera right here that looks out into this general direction i want you to pay attention up here in the sky you can't miss it this is back from april of 2020 this occurred at 5 44 p.m and that would be local time in their area you see it right right there starting to appear and what chris did was he filmed the screen of his monitor I'm waiting on the raw file of this particular segment of the video that he shared with me uh, to see if we can get an even better view of what he's describing as a portal in the sky. Very unique rectangle, looks like a, vert a vertical rectangle, and you can see lights every once in a while off to the left, and you can see one above, there it just disappeared, and then it will reappear again. And then I take some enhancements of this video clip, as you'll see here in just a moment. I tried to zoom in as best I could on a couple of the lights. You can see two or three random like orange lights in the area, and then there's one above whatever this thing may be. I don't know what it is. I'm not claiming to know. It's just one of those that's that's too good not to share. And I did verify that there is something up there because it is behaving to light like everything else is in the sky. You can see clouds up there and even those wires, they do respond to the light in the sky. And so does this thing. If it was something other than, than what's in the sky, it wouldn't respond to the light equally like everything else does. And I'll show you what I mean here in just a second whenever I do a, a light adjustment. Here's an enhancement right here, and this is basically a negative format. You're gonna see this thing look very dark in the sky. The bottom and top part of it appear to be glowing almost in this type of a format. Unreal. The guy was absolutely mystified when he saw this on his security camera monitor. Couldn't believe it. See how the top and bottom are, they look like they're glowing here, but that's actually like a shadow. 
here you're going to see that it reflects light. See how bright that is? If that was something that was added after the fact, it wouldn't be responding to the light. And there's not that much light in the sky anyway because it's, it's pretty cloudy. And whatever this structure is appears to be behind some sort of a fog, maybe a thin layer of clouds as you can see right here. See right there in the front? It's got like a thin layer of fog or something around it and even behind it. See right there, a little flash of light. There's two. There's an orange light there and there that appear. One up here that remains pretty steady, but it's difficult to tell because whenever, right there it is, whenever you record a monitor, you get these weird wavy lines in your video. So I was waiting on the, the raw file of this moment from Chris whenever he gets my email. He hasn't got my email yet, so I'm going to review that whenever he sends it. There was a light right there. Did you see it? A little orange light. There's orange orbs up there in that area as well. There was another one right there. And you can see the fog going in front of this thing that looks like a looks like an old time telephone booth or something. A vertical rectangle that's got a rectangle inside of it. Very, very unique. I've never seen anything quite like this in the sky or any type of video footage. And, and I'm not claiming to know what that is. It's just another one of those moments that's, that's too good not to share. But whenever I get the raw file from Chris, I'll definitely share that with you guys. Here's a look at some brand new sky photos that have been sent in from all around the world. Gloriana out of Puerto Rico. Spectacular glowing cloud. Tamara out of Florence, Arizona. Rain shafts dropping down out of the low clouds. Round Valley, California. Steve T. Fiery orange sunset. Steve Z out of Fullerton, uh, California. Very red. That was a moon. Also a photo of the sun. Same location by Steve Z. Here they are side by side. Sun, moon, red and orange. Petersburg, Indiana. Tyler F. Got the sun behind wildfire smoke there as well. Here we've got a very ominous looking low to the ground shelf cloud that Tyler noticed before some storms here a few days ago. Another ominous looking sky photo out of Indiana. Tony T sent this in and asked me if I knew what could possibly cause that. And to me, when I look at that, it looks like something went tumbling through the clouds. It's very intermittent like holes in the clouds. I don't know, it's very unique. This girl out of Louisiana, what appears to be more wildfire smoke. Wiley B out of Bend, Oregon, we've got a, a purple lenticular cloud. How about that? Winter Haven, Florida, William H. Very ominous looking dark storm clouds over Florida. Here we've got an awesome sunrise that William sees all the time from Winter Haven. Tania D out of Perrysburg, Ohio. More wildfire smoke interacting with the sun like we see here out of Tennessee. Stuart G noticed the same thing. Been getting a lot of those photos. Stephanie R out of Rogers, Arkansas. What looks like a red vortex. Robert L, Blytheville, Arkansas. Very spectacular sunset. Central California, Ray D was filming the smoke in front of the, the sun at sunset when a jet appeared out of nowhere, literally. Couldn't see it over here in the smoke and it flew right in front of the sun as he was filming the sun on that day. Here we've got what we're calling a bizarre sky. This video clip was sent in by Mom the Ruler out of, or as she was flying to Alaska, and there was a big square up in the sky, pretty much in the proximity of the, of the sun. See it right there? It's like a big rectangle. Look at that. That's actually in the sky. That's a cloud. Unreal. Northeast Georgia, Misty Day K. We've got a third rainbow here. See it? See that shaft going up? Got the double decker there. And then a third one shooting off all by itself. Here we've got another big lenticular cloud hovering above the mountains. Matt P. Chicago. Very intense double decker rainbow. That thing is huge. Looks like a big gateway. Get a load of that. That is absolutely massive. Got the purple right there too. You don't always see that. You do on that one. Rachel N. out of Minnesota. Big halo around the sun. Big Island, Hawaii. Catherine S. Very red sunset from Hawaii. Southeast Wisconsin. Jody took this photo of what looks like a big oval in the sky. See it right there? See right there? A big oval looking structure. And you got like a rainbow right there in front of or at least in the proximity 
of the sun. That's what compelled her to take the photograph. Longboat Key, Florida, God is love. We have a giant orange thunderhead visible from Florida out over the ocean. Great job, guys. Keep the photos coming. If you have any photos you'd like to share, you can send those to reports at MrMBB333.com. All of the photos end up here at the Sky Phenomena Photo Gallery, and sometimes I'll use them in a picture slideshow just like you saw right here. Thanks for watching. Have a super day, and be safe out there.